In the age of ancients, the world was unformed, shrouded by fog. A land of grey crags, arch trees, and everlasting dragons. But then there was fire, and with fire came disparity, heat and cold, life and death, and of course, light and dark. Then, from the dark, they came and found the souls of lords within the flame. Nito, the first of the dead. The Witch of Isolith and her Daughters of Chaos. Gwyn, the Lord of Sunlight and his Faithful Knights. And the furtive Pygmy, so easily forgotten. With the strength of lords, they challenge the dragons. Gwyn's mighty bolts peeled apart their stone skins. The witches weaved great firestorms. Nito unleashed a miasma of death and disease. Soon the flames will fade, and only dark will remain. Even now, there are only embers, and man sees not light, but only endless nights. And amongst the living are seen Carriers of the accursed dark side. Yes, indeed. The dark sign brands the undead. And in this land, the undead are corralled and led to the north. Where they are locked away to await the end of the world.
Holy! Stop clicking. <laughs> Hello, YouTube. My name is Bandicoot, and welcome back to... And we're off. <laughs> Dark Souls Remastered. We're playing this. Let, let's go. I've got Dakota here. Uh, so we're going to be trying this co-op. For those of you unfamiliar with it, to do co-op, at least one of us will have to get past the um, Taurus demon. Uh, yeah. The second boss in the game. So, we're just going to kind of be playing and chatting. And then... I yeah. don't remember that in the original game. Yeah. Uh, cause so Description for Black Fire Bob. <laughs> just read it. <laughs> oh yeah. More deadly than STG Bomb. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna make this super easy. I'm a female knight named Bob the Builder. Alright, and there we go. That is the history of Dark Souls. My god, I always forget how ugly these characters are. <laughs> that... <laughs> Press A to pillage corpse. Presses B instead. Oh yeah, that that's useful. Alright. That... So I frame. forgot there was a way to run around the boss. Did you die? Like four times. <laughs> what was your starting gift? Black fire bombs. Why don't you use those to kill us? So you no, get a uh, hammer. I will, on my way back. Well, no, you'll only get the hammer if you kill it your first time. Well, I already messed up then. <laughs> Rip. Uh, I also don't want to play a knight because my role is so. I think I always played as the thief. Yeah. She was more nimble. Yeah, I play as the thief because then you basically because you start with the master key as well. So it's like you get two starting gifts. Oh, you do get two? Basically, because you get the... Because the Master Key is one of the starting gifts you can choose. But the Thief starts with the Master Key. So, I mean, if you want the Demon's Hammer, you can always get it when you play through on New Game Plus, I think. I've never been through there, but you can also just kill it now. With black fire I'm gonna kill it now. Honestly, I was thinking about restarting anyway because of the roll. <laughs> I mean, every character you couldn't always. That's the main thing in my play. Yeah. You can always get lighter armor, of course. I know. Now, honestly, a lot of the times when I play this, I just start as a. Uh, what's it called? Um, the Deprived, with no starting gift. I don't get a starting gift? No. Um, you can choose not to have a starting gift. And the Deprived starts with very basic equipment. So... Deprived class with no starting gift. So you're pretty much giving yourself hard mode. Yeah, I mean... It's really not that bad. Oh, hey, a person. Oh, you. 
You're no hollow. Thank goodness. I'm done for, I'm afraid. I'll die soon. Alright, let's see how this goes. Let me show us something of you. You and I, we're both undead. Hear me out, will you? What's your decision? Regrettably, yes. I have failed in my mission. But perhaps you can keep the torch lit. There is an old saying in my family. Thou who art undead art chosen. And thine exodus from the undead... I don't remember how to use my firebombs. Axe. The land of Axe. Lords, when thou ringeth the bell of awakening... Axe. The fate of the undead thou shalt know. Well, now you know. And I can die with hope in my heart. Oh, one more thing. Here, take this. Oh, shoot. Mr. Flask, an undead favorite. What? Oh, and this. Now I must bid for Killed me, and I had already used three of my firebombs. you after death. So go now. <laughs> uh, you only need five. So, you know, if you use I, five or six, it depends. Make sure you're using lock-on. Basically, just lock-on, yeah. throw a firebomb, dodge attack, throw a firebomb, dodge attack. Where are you, big butt? There you are. Yeah, I accidentally uh, threw a firebomb because I accidentally hit X. No, not like that. That, uh, whatever. And unequip, so I don't do that again. It's been so long since I played this. I'm forgetting what all the buttons do. Because everything. I get a hammer, recover my souls. Can I just go straight out this door now? No, because you it doesn't drop the big pilgrim's key if you kill him. <laughs> then you get it from the dude who gives you the Estus flask. I have one firebomb left. Perry, stab him in the gut. And. Oh no, there's not a monster here for me to do my fall attack on. I hear you, stray demon. You stay down there. I'll be back for you later. And I accidentally threw my last flask. You threw one of your Astus flasks? Wow, it's impressive. You know, you know what? <laughs> Only in the ancient legends it is stated that one day an undead shall be chosen. This says tears ahead. Asylum in pilgrimage <laughs> to the land of the ancient lords. Lordran. Oh yeah, isn't there like... A rock. What is this about a rock? Anastas flask. Let me help you out. There are actually two bells of awakening. One's up above in the undead church. The other is far, far below. In the ruins at the base of Blight Town. Ring them both, and something happened. 
brilliant track. Not much to go on. I have a feeling I can stop you. So, off you go. It is why you came, isn't it? To this accursed land, the undead. <laughs> After playing Dead Rising, I keep hitting X to try to attack. I also want to hold right bumper to sprint, and it's like, no, that's an attack. Yeah, switching between games is always like this. Especially Dark Souls. Yeah, I... I should probably figure out how to adjust settings for this controller and change things up for the second keybind setting. So you've got uh, an elite controller. That'd probably be a huge benefit to some of the things in this game. Right now I'm playing on CAD settings. <laughs> My bottom left paddle is basically useless, as it is A. Ah, yes. Well, that's this is off to a great start. I just jumped off a cliff. So, rip. I recovered, so that's good. There we go, made it onto the bridge. To get. Can adjust the brightness of the controller. What is this? The brightness of the. You can make the controller smarter. The Xbox logo. You can make it light different. Fortunately, not colors. Mm -hmm. Suppose that'd be useful. I can't think of any specific situations, but I'm sure it has its uses. Ow! Uh. Okay, yeah, I got use up Nestus Flask. Not that button. That's not the attack button in this game. I just did what you you've been doing. Hit X to try to attack. Oh, I accidentally hit my paddle. What'd you do? Oh. No, I dodged out of an attack. Um... I accidentally hit my paddle and it dodged me out of the way. Of an attack I didn't see coming. I have those bound to the same button, so that's why I wasn't being able to attack. Cool. A left bumper. Right bumper. There we go. I was like, why am I kicking him off? Why am I still holding up my shield? What's going on? Nani? Come here, buddy. Hey, merchant oh, fella. You seem to have your wits. Then you are a welcome customer. I trade for souls. Everything's for sale. Just almost walked off the cliff. <laughs> Ow, that was a firebomb threw at me. Well that was rude. Yeah, these enemies can be quite da rude. That's okay, I'm just repeatedly kicking them off cliffs. <laughs> <laughs> I almost stepped off a cliff. Yeah, don't do that. Oh, shoot. You know what? Can you stop throwing firebombs in my face? That'd be great. Okay, I'm glad that guy didn't do any more damage than he did with that attack, because that would have killed me. I want to jump over and grab that, but I know I'm probably going to die if I do. 
It's a ring of sacrifice. Is that good? Uh, you keep everything the next time you die, but the ring will break. I mean, I, I oh. never wanted to use one. I think every time I've had one, I was like, I want to save this, and then I never use it. Yeah. Okay, nope, don't kill me. Oh god, I ever all of them. Oh, this is bad. Watch down this long spooky turtle. See, all right, you're dead. So that just leaves you with the spear. Hey, you with the bombs? Stop. <laughs> Yeah. Come on. Dodge. I forgot about the ragdoll physics in this game. I love this. Yeah. Yeah, why didn't you dodge? <laughs> Oh, uh, the boss we need to beat's the one on the bridge, isn't it? Yeah. And Solaire's on the other side. Alright, kill the crystal lizard. Remember trying to shoot the dragon tail off? Yeah. You wary of liar? Jump over that bridge. Huh? There's a broken bridge in between buildings. Can you not jump it? You cannot make that jump, no. You have to go. There's a way to go down. No, before I try it another 20 times. <laughs> yeah. There's a way you can get up on the roof and then you can jump onto the other side of the bridge from there. I mean, there might be a way, but it's just easier to go up and around. Hey, hey Taurus Demon, eat my tiny knife in your neck. Okay, you're doing that attack. Oh, you haven't made it out of the Asylum yet? Huh? Oh no, I killed the Asylum Demon. I'm at the... Taurus Demon, that's the next boss. Oh, wow. Yeah, I've uh, I've played this game a few times. My feeling when we're gonna... When I'm playing Dark Souls again. Aw shit, here we go again. Alright, is there anyone... Can I open this door? I can. It's in here. Nothing. Alright, I'm about to light the fire. The next fire. Ow. Okay. I didn't refill my flash? Uh, the fl the Firelink Shrine is already kindled once because it's a as a bonfire keeper. So you'll only refill the five at every other bonfire until you kindle them. That's right. 
Yep. I'm oh my god, I think my- yep, yeah, my sister's added me to another group chat. <laughs> Joy. Oh, poop. Are you know what's yeah, my watch is going crazy. Oh, my phone went off. We both need to beat the boss. Uh, no, only one of us needs to beat it to unlock the stone, and then the other person can... Like, I beat it so I can go get the white sign soapstone, and you can summon me. You need to be human in order to do that. So... You'd have to get a humanity and... Ah, hello. Yeah. You look hollow, so far from it. I am Soler of Astora, an adherent of the Lord of Sunlight. Now that I am undead, I have come to this great land, the birthplace of Lord Gwyn, to seek my very own son. You find that strange? Oh, that's right, there's two of these fuckers. No need to hide your reaction. I get that look all the time. <laughs> Oh, aha. So I didn't scare you. I have a proposition, if you have a moment. The way I see it, our fates appear to be in time, in a land brimming with hollows. Could that really be mere chance? So what do you say? Why not help one another on this lonely journey? This pleases me greatly. Well then, take a chest. Oh, five black fire bombs. Strange beings in a strange land. The flow of time itself is convoluted, with heroes centuries old fading. I hope it's not a mimic. <laughs> and relations shift and obscure. There's no telling how much longer your world and mine will remain in contact. I am getting. <laughs> this is not fun. Cross the gaps between the worlds and engage in jolly cooperation. Of course, we are not the only ones engaged in this. But I am a warrior of the sun. Spot my summon signature easily by its brilliant aura. If you miss it, you must be blind. <laughs> Ow! Hey. Okay. So I have the soapstone now. I'm gonna go unlock the shortcut. And then there are new Dragon Ball Super cards. So I want to look at those. Oh no, that wasn't another enemy, that's a ghost. <laughs> Someone's ghost just scared me. Nice. Yeah. I'm in the undead bird. Okay. Know where the shortcut is. Yeah. It's not unlocked for me yet. Like someone isn't trying hard enough. I've always played carefully in this game. I know. I've just played this so many times. Still keeping your mark and go ahead. Never hurts. <laughs> yeah. I'm just talking to you because there's more things I want to buy. Oh, thank you very much. Come back soon. <laughs> yeah, you're not creepy at all. Sure. There's no other spot to refill my flash before the boss, is there? Nope. And unless you get lucky and get a piece of humanity from one of the enemies, the best way to get humanity is to without. I have four. Hard humanities or soft humanities? I don't know. It just says humanity. Like the items. Just to gain one humanity plus greatly restore HP. Yeah, those are. Uh, what we call, what are called hard humanities, because they're items. Humanity is like the stat, the number in the top left. Yeah, the best way to get humanity is just to throw it on your uh, soapstone and join someone.
and assist them in defeating the boss because you get a soft humanity for doing that. Okay, I thought I failed that jump for a second. Just keep in mind, if you defeat the Taurus Demon, I can't help you with, like, the Black Knight or Havel the Rock. Eh. Okay. Oh, I said, huh? Like, oh, what does that mean? Uh, you know the big stony guy with the giant weapon? That has super high def- I just got killed. That is super high defense. In the bottom of the tower, leading up to where the boss is, there's this door you can oh, take. Oh, yeah. Through. Yeah. Have all the rocks at the bottom of that, and that's the guy that is a pain to fight. Oh. So, how do I get you in here, then? You need to have a soft humanity and reverse your hollowing at the bonfire. First. Oh, so I'm good to... Soft humanity is a stat, hard humanity is the item. So you'd have to use one of your item humanities in order to become human oh, to be able to. Oh, now I have a hard humanity. I thought you said you had four. I don't know where I got it, but. Or this uh, stat, the one in my top. Corner. Okay, that's soft humanity. You, there's a chance of getting one of those every time you kill an enemy in this game. So, let me go recover because I am an idiot and died. And then... That's the wrong button. Frick. And then we can set up co-op. We can set up the password system and then we can play. Alright, rest at bonfire. So what do I do? Reverse hollow? Yeah, reverse hollowing. And now if you'll di if you die, you will become uh, hollow again. So, you know, avoid that. Yeah. Yeah. So... I try to avoid it anyway, but I'll, I'll be extra cautious. Yeah. Alright. Hello! Hello. Pop the builder. <laughs> Alright. So. I'm gonna go. Let's go find you all the items that are to be found in this area. You got the I wooden? got that. You got the wooden? Right. Didn't even go this way yet. Okay. Watch out! Oh, hi. I forgot about you. Okay, you got him. Oh, this guy's dead. He's just broken. Oh, yeah. Also, oh. they changed the way that, like, Estus Flask... Ah, uh, I didn't want to do that. Work, in, ...work now. Uh, basically, I get half the Estus Flasks I would normally get in, uh, this area. Yeah, there's an enemy in there. Uh, instead of, like, you can... Okay, that was wonky. Uh, so if you remember in the original release of this game, like, anytime you used an Estus Flask, I would be healed. You'd heal all the phantoms. They changed it in this one. So you... Oof. So I have different... I have my own collection of Estus Flasks. Uh, that is a merchant. He sells you things. I'm gonna kill him. Don't do that. And then down here, there's four of the unarmored, hollowed things. These annoying buggers. Oh, 
Can you jump off ladders? Uh, no, you can sl if you hold B, you slide down them. And then, up here. Ah, oh, throwing knives. That's how you get to the other side of this broken bridge. <laughs> and then, up around here, there's an item. You go that way. Yeah. I suppose. There's also a dead guy down there. Yeah. Right, I'll be right back. I need to go uh, do something for seven hours. <laughs> Alright, come on. So we come down here. We can... Oh, uh, okay. I almost fell. There's an enemy in that room to the... Yeah, you got him. <laughs> Please stop murdering us. Thank you. Alright, and then we roll... We come down here. There's an item right here. Free! And then come down here. And then in this doorway right here. There's a body right here. Uh, yeah, that's blocked off. That just leads up to where, when you first come to the Undead Burg, those first two enemies you see, there's nothing back there. Come up. This way. Gorgeous view ahead. Yeah, gorgeous view of a bunch of enemies that are trying to uh, attack you. Howdy. Yeah, found rubbish. Nice. And then we come up here. And there's a stud body here. Free! Humanity! Alright, and that's all the items from this part of the Undead Burg. Oh, you can just jump up here. Huh? Yeah, you can. But, uh... Since you um, have You see this guy? Huh? You see this guy? Do I see what guy? He's floating right in front of me, walking sideways. No. There's nothing there for me. Okay, I'm recording it. Okay. Um, so yeah, that's all the items. Uh, you can just jump up there and then go back around, but that very first item we got by dropping down here, you can only get by dropping down here. So, it's easier to do it that way. Alright. And now we fight the big guy with the black armor, right? Uh, that'll be in a minute. First, we need to reach him. So... Okay, I've got two Astus flasks. I have one. I hit the wrong button. Now I have one. I love this game. <laughs> yeah. Alright, in here... Open! 
Does not open from this side. There's one right there to your left. I've played this game a few times. Yeah, that's a shortcut once you reach unlock the lower undead berg. There's an item in here. You've already gotten it. Okay. Let me come up here. Now, one thing you can do if you're having trouble with these enemies, Ow! the firebomb guy will. I just funnel them down here. Yeah. Well, the firebomb guy will slowly, like when you reach the top of the stairs, will start walking towards you. But I find it easier to just go on, be aggressive. That kill him or did he just fall? Where did he fall down to? No. Is there an No. There's missiles. Okay. Fell off the map. There aren't any items down here. Okay. So you got that item. Th okay. There's a door in here with the chest. Yup. You'd normally need the resin. gold resin. Yeah. You'd normally need the residence key, but we got the master key. Because we're both sneaky thieves. Oh, I got another humanity from him. Nice. Okay. And now back up. I'm also at half health. I didn't sneak attack him. Yeah. Before we actually fight the boss, I would not mind going and getting uh, the heal spell. Where's that at? Uh... Okay, I need to use Master's Flask. It There's an NPC back in Firelink Shrine who'll sell it for like 4,000 souls. Oh, so I've got enough. Yeah. Oh, Pillage Corpse. Come here. Night Night Shard. Don't get up, you're just embarrassing oh, he's still yourself. Alive. No, he's not. It's just delayed. Oh. Yep. And then, before we continue down... Isn't the guy in black armor down there? Yeah, but we don't want this guy coming down at us. First is a barrel. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Parry, shivy, shivy, shank, shank. I can't heal. I'm gonna use my last shard if we're gonna fight a big one. Your last flask? Yep. Okay. Be very quiet. Hunting wabbits. Mm-hmm. Oh, I also have those black fire bombs. We don't need him. This guy's a pushover. Come on, you. Eh. You gonna put <laughs> your back to me? Oh. 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 I can't get a special hit from behind for whatever reason. I parried okay. him. Okay, so I'm almost dead. We're good, he's dead. Alright. So come here and grab this ring. This is the blue tier stone ring. It'll raise your defense while your health is low. Should probably put that on, like, right meow, because I'm, like, one hit away. Yeah, well, definitely we're probably going to want to go and get, uh... I want to go by the heal spell. So, is there anything else down here? Like, uh, well, there's actually since there's no other enemies, 
Uh, if you come... That just drops into oblivion. Yeah. No, there, there's nothing else down there. Oh, we may as well... So, through that door, this door right here, is Havel the Rock. And then if we come up here... This fog door is what the boss. if you die here? Uh, I mean, I despawn and then you have to resummon me. And in those barrels, there is a Titanite Lizard. And boom. So yeah. I would not go through that yet, since we're at very low I health. <laughs> we pr you probably want to go rest the bonfire. And I definitely want to go by the heal spell. Yeah, I'm probably going to do that. Yeah. So... Is that just, like, unlimited uses? No, it's got five uses. So, I'm gonna go home. Oh god! I just almost walked off the map. Would not recommend. Yeah. That is, uh, that is a hazard. Hello, warrior waist cloth. Alright, I didn't aggro him. So yeah, once you get back to Firelink Shrine, there's a staircase through an archway that you can go I up. I like the castle thing. Yeah. And then there's three other archways. One of them leads to the giant uh, reflection pool. And then there's one that leads to just a little corridor, which has an item at the end of it. And the other one has an NPC, a swole boy. That's a very dark room. And he is the one who has <gasps> miracles for sale. You'll have to talk to him a few times to get him to, uh, actually sell you things. But... Come again. The effect. Copper coin. Yep. So you talk to him again, he'll offer to teach you miracles, you say yes, Stuff. I gotta join this covenant, right? Yeah. Alright, and where's this? So, to your right, when you're ta facing him, talking to him, there's another staircase. You go up that, go up the next staircase. There's another staircase going up that has a little item on it. But on that, that. first landing... There's the archways that the lifts would be on. You jump into there. And there's a little hallway. I can't see. You jump out of that. And there are four total chests. Yeah, they have a bunch of neat loots. If you can't see, turn your game's brightness up. Six homeward bones. And then once Morning you Star and a talisman. I found three chests. Uh yeah, there's three chests Correct, in red eye room. that initial room. And then there's one on a okay, cliff. Okay, I see this room. Yeah. And then to get out from here you have to jump off the cliff and then just run straight up the stairs back towards Firelink Shrine because you cannot permanently kill the skeletons here. Oh, that's cool. Without a weapon with faith. And if you take the stairs, like once you go up the first set out of the cemetery, if you go up another set of stairs, you turn to your left and go all the way around, you'll be like above the reflection pool. <laughs> There's an item The skeleton here. followed me. 
Yeah, in that case, I would just run. And then we'll... You can come back later and easily make it up there without aggroing the skeletons. I'll do it later, because she almost killed me. Alright, and you're... I forgot I rested, now there's enemies. That's the wrong button. There we go. All right. Why are you in here already? Because now he doesn't have to bear have to open the door. Whatever, he's dead. Ah, poop. Oh, well, I guess not the worst timing. Oh, he did drop a helmet, though. Neat. We don't need to kill these enemies, but I have had times where they will... ...eventually migrate up. I'm gonna shoot myself. That's the second flask I've accidentally used. Stop doing that. Yeah. Tell me about it. I just did. item. Firebombs. Hmm. You know what? I have that on the wrong side. There we go. I'll get this. Oh, okay. I guess you can, have, you can get the crossbowmen. Didn't work. All right, and then kill this guy. The Black Knight does not respawn, so don't have to worry about that. No fire bomb or flaming barrel. Nope. One time only. Alright. Opens the door. Hello! I'm here to fluff your pillows! Alright, one second. Don't not see him. Oh, I just like glitched into the wall. We have to go down further. I knew that. Now, more likely than not, he if he hits you, you're dead. That's good to know. So, yeah. Dodge. I could've put my firebomb in there. Firebombs don't do a whole lot to him. He has high fire resist, too. Is there a reason I can't backstab? Are you holding right bumper or are you just tapping it? Cause I think you just... Oh no! I, I don't know. I'm holding it. Tapping it works too. I don't know. Oh wait, right bumper. No, I think I'm tapping it. Yeah, why would I hold it? Ah. Hmm. hmm. Well. Kill this bolt. Yeah. 
Yeah, right bumper is for sneak attacks. You can't use the trigger. Yeah, I have uh, the bumpers bound to my paddles, so I've just been tapping them. Well, I guess you have to go recover now. I'll be at the fire. I just gotta reverse hollow, summon you, and go get my souls back, right? <laughs> well, you lose any soft humanity you have as well. Ah, uh, poop. Yeah. So what if I were to use my hard humanity? <laughs> that would, uh... That would give you humanity with which to resummon me, so that would work. So do I gotta make my own soup? Soup? You going clothes shopping? Yeah, I, You know what? <laughs> I'll poop. Good thing I didn't go off the map. Yeah. And your previous souls would have been irrecoverable. Yeah, that's why I was so adamant about having you here. <laughs> to help me get there without dying. Yeah, that's fair. Back up. Oh, this was a bad idea. I got the sword guy and the spear guy. It's too shy to... Okay, well he did that. Alright. Ow! Dakota, stop getting hit. I just got there. Good thing I decided against using my heal. Ow, you shit. Alright, my first order of business is going to be collecting my souls. Yeah? I'd like my world to be a little lighter, but... I don't think it's a good idea to take off any more armor than this. I mean, he's going to one-hit you anyway, right? Yeah. Or not! Holy shit! No, it wasn't... Uh... That's not my worry, it's for uploading purposes. For YouTubes, because I am female. I wonder. It's not because I'm holding a shield, is it? Uh, no. No, I shouldn't. I mean, if you're holding it up, then yeah. Oh. Well, I'm dead. I see that. Stop doing that. I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> Stop doing that. You recovered, right? Yes. Okay. First thing I did. Good. Parry! Yeah. Apparently you can parry Havel the Rock. I'm not a fan to try. Alright, now go in holding my sword like this. I actually take off my... Normally I take everything off except for my weapon. But I'm not going to do that because YouTube. So, keeping my chest piece and yeah. legs on. Because the less stuff you have the lighter you roll. So... Just run it again. Oh dear. Okay. I have recovered! Hey, 
Where is your sun god now, Havel the Rock? Oh shit. I would suggest running. I backstabbed him. Yeah. Oh, I've got three humanity now. How far will he follow me? Uh, he will not follow you out of the tower. I hope. But he'll go up all the levels? Yeah. I'm gonna sit in the tower to his doorway. The I hope he doesn't come up here. Tower to his doorway? Doorway in the tower to his room. Okay. Hello. Hello. Are you ready to die again? Whoa! Mr. Cannon Fodder. That that's literally why I'm here. Cause if I die there is no punishment. Besides, you know, waiting. Oh, he tried to juke me out. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen that before, actually. Boop, boop, boop. Oh. I should have been out of that, I dodged. I saw that. Woo! Oh my god! They were aiming the firebombs at you, and you normally run past them, but since they were aimed ahead, I kept running into them. So instead of aiming them at where you are, they aim them at where you're going to be. Yes, like they should. Yeah. Or like they shouldn't, because they're stupid NPCs. And one more enemy! Badoop. Where are you at? I went down. I'm not going all the way down yet, but I went down. Okay. Yeah, I was... Mud I was changing equipment around a bit. Alright, well... I could hit him with that giant sword we got from the other place. The hammer? Or... Uh, oh god! No! Your... Because of your recover, stats, recover, recover. its damage will be... too low. I went to recover and he landed right on where my souls were. <laughs> I don't think that's dealing... No, it's actually dealing less damage than my... dagger was. Hmm. Hey, <laughs> did it! Good job. You said it here. Okay, thank you. No! Run. <laughs> I couldn't run. He hit you, literally stood up, turned around, and hit me. Rip! Alright, so this time, wait until I get to the other side of the bridge. Yeah, that was going to. Okay. Which are... Over here. For whatever reason. Alright, Havel, come this way. 
Yeah, that just kind of tinged off of him. Hmm. I mean, he's called Havel the Rock for a reason. Is it because he's related to Dwayne? Yeah. His full name is Havel the Rock Johnson. Nah, his armor is literally made out of stone. Run. He is chasing me this time. Run faster! Oh sh! Don't <laughs> die. He turned around and he was like, I'm coming for you. <laughs> Alright, so he's not coming up here. Okay, good. And also, you can access the Darkroot Garden. Which... Does things... Also... I could get the Drake Sword. That does do more damage to him. I'm gonna do that real quick. If I have the Master Key, I go and get... Okay, there we go. I got the sword. I go and get the, uh... I don't have enough strength. I need to level my strength up. I don't have enough X... God dang it. Hmm. Well, morning star it is. Did you get the sword? Uh, I only have nine strings. I need at least twelve to be able to two-hand it. Uh. Yeah. How can you use the morning star if I can't? I'm two-handing it. I should say, cannot use it with effectively with present stats, uh, wield it in two hands, or whatever. Read. That only does- Holy damage? Oh wait, no, he was already damaged. Yeah. Only does 23 damage. Well, that did 55. Yeah. Shoot! I fell down the stairs. Let's hope that the bleed does something, if I can build it up. Oh, ho, ho. This won't even give you the ring, will it? Nope. You're not dead? I... Apparently not. Alright, how did that not hit me? Okay, perfect. I'm gonna put the bandit's knife back on. I'm pretty sure it also inflicts bleed. Yeah, it does. Okay. My anger to God. I honestly didn't know if that would hit me. I kind of got scared there. Okay. I... Suddenly couldn't attack for a moment. Why? What is happening? Can you not attack? I I can't backstab him. Yeah. I lock into position, but
Yeah. Oh, uh, let his attention. See if I can. I can. There we go. Now I can. Oh, you can. There we go. Why did that do so? It gets up to damage? face you. Oh poop! <laughs> Why is it only doing twenty-eight damage? Maybe it's not willing. Weapons break or something. Oh shoot! You're right. They can uh lose durability. Hmm. <laughs> Oh boy. Well, uh. In that case, uh. This'll do more damage. Almost got him. Or, yeah, it does 29. Yes! Oh my god. <laughs> we did it! Okay. L let me see what the durability... No, the durability is still... That's so weird. I don't... Okay, whatever. Um... Okay. Well. So he won't respawn, will he? Correct. Okay, now we kill a boss? Now we kill a boss. And I get to use the souls to up my strength to be able to use the Drake Sword. Then we get me the Drake Sword. <laughs> yep. And I've, already, I've got arrows, so I may as well make use of them. Stuck in the rat trap, Kale. Huh? It's a pyramid scheme. Oh, you have to go first. I will bring you with me, right? No, actually, when you go through this particular white fog gate, uh, I permanently get banned from your world. RIP. <laughs> Alright, so I cannot I aggro... I aggro him out, don't I? Yeah, you have to aggro him out. I'll kill these crossbow people. Or there's just one? What? Okay, that's really weird. All right, so, so you just go. Just tell me when you're ready. I I'm ready. Just start heading towards the other fog gate, and when you see him up on that, yep, run back. Climb up the ladder. I will do a drop attack on him, and then once he re fully recovers from that. You do a drop attack on him. Okay, now it's your turn. Yep. Also, yeah, I'm. That's definitely dealing a lot less damage than normal. I can't get back to the ladder. Oh my god! Climb, climb. Get up! Get up! Get up! I wanted to heal before he hit me again and killed me. That's fair. Alright. I'm gonna make the climb. So that way my drop attack can stun him. Oh boy. And I'm on the ground again. Oh my god. Please tell me you're ready. Oh! Go! Climb! Quickly! You see my health, right? Yes! <laughs> I didn't put back on my talisman. All right, time to drink some Estus. All right, while you're doing that, I'm gonna. Oh, that did a lot of damage. Miss me, fatty. Okay, 
that that's doing a lot more. Climb, climb. Geronimo, I he was stuck, wasn't he? That or I somehow missed. That's alright. He's dead. Okay. Woo! <laughs> wow. Thank you. Hi. Bye. Oh, wow. Alright, time to put on my talisman. That was a lot. Hey, I got another humanity. I just tried to drink an empty Estus flask. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, there will be more of this uh, at some point, probably. But, uh. One of this tomfoolery. Yeah. <laughs> so, thank you for watching and hope you enjoyed, and see you all next time.